Isn't she grand and miraculous, Tyler? It's just a ball, Sarah. <laughs> Hello. Hello, everyone. I'm with Tyler. We are here to get birthday present for Peter. And he... memories for us. And memories for us. Peter's going to be meeting us up in just a little bit. But because this one is a cast member, he's going to help a girl out. And I'm going to show him the DVC lounge. Yeah. Tyler, what's your first impression of the DVC lounge? Um, I don't feel like I deserve to be there. I don't you feel completely fancy do. enough. You are fancy enough. It's so it's cool here during sunset because it's getting like mood lighting. Hey Sarah. Hi. Oh. Peter's here. I'm here, but we got food. What's the tosta de tinga? Tostada. Toast. Oh, that's a beautiful. Look at this beautiful photo that Tyler took. That is on the new iPhone X. iPhone 10. And Tyler's here. Hey. He's already been introduced. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm new to the, I'm new to the day. <laughs> the good? Look at this. Look at this this shirt that we've never seen before. So We're at the Nordic Pavilion. It's a frozen ever after. So that sweet. Is epic. Super sweet. And it's like different sweets. And look at Sarah's cool girl jacket. Jill gave her this actually. I think it's from the 90s. It is totally from the 90s. It looks like it's from the 90s. Oh, we had one person say they knew when we use the gimbal in our Christmas tree trapping now. And so if you're watching this, send us your address and we'll send you a poster. So, are we gonna go see this movie? I want. I've never seen it. We've never seen it. It's a confession. I, besides Tyler, have you only seen France? I've done Canada before too. So, Tyler saw France today? No, like a week ago. No, Thanksgiving week. We have we have not done like the country movies. None of them. Canada was really good. Tyler did Canada no, 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 and no. recently France was really really good. Recently did France and has nothing but great things to say. The about music it. was really good. It's Ooh. like 18 minutes yeah. long. Should we do it? Let's just do Let, it. Let's just do it. It's not even seven o'clock. Right, and that's the other thing. I was. That's why I turned on the camera. Because I am pretty darn hungry. We'll we'll we'll, we'll run to food after this. Um, we, we realized had this plan that we were gonna do them all in one day, but now there's no Norway one. And I feel like there was another one that, that's not there, so it's not as big of a day event as I thought it was going to be. And we're here early because we I came straight from work because Sarah came here with Tyler, so it's early for us to be in the park. Um, did you know this beautiful dome was inside this building in Epcot my whole life? Because I did not. And look at over here, look at this. This is ridiculous. Look how big this room is. Is this not part of the store over here? <gasps> There's a Shanghai Disney Resort thing. <gasps> Adventure. Uh, <gasps> this is. <gasps> this is all Shanghai. Wow, I've never done this. That's Sarah. Look at that. Look at that. <gasps> That's tomorrow in Shanghai. Oh my God! I'm, two of my friends went here this year. How have I never been back here? Oh my God! Look at these cute things. Oh. We need more than 14 minutes. The magic is here. You're invited. What is this? This is everything. The, the signs of the zodiac are a significant part of... Look at the Disney zodiac signs. Yeah, the monkey. Wandering Moon Tea House. Tomorrowland. Look at this. This is what we're getting. Are these yeah, I still don't know how I feel about that. Oh I, what do you mean you don't know how you feel about it? It's going to be great. They're I, not taking away anything from the parks. I feel like they need to take out Tomorrowland Speedway, though. No. no. Sarah loves it. Congratulations. She also loves a Little Mermaid, which I did for the first time in Hollywood Studios. Did you like it? Mm. Oh, come on! <laughs> look at these, look at these costumes from Disney oh. Shanghai. I want to go so bad. And instead of Main Street, they've got Mickey Avenue. Oh my god, Silly Symphony's Music Store. Don't just get a haircut, get a mall cut. I found, I'm touching banners. 
I found banners. Oh, Adventure Isle, Treasure Cove, Gardens of Imagination, Inside Shanghai oh, Disney Resort. Now that's gonna be stuck in my head. Mickey Avenue, Tomorrowland, Tennis Land. You're touching a bench? All right, now let's go see this historically accurate cultural representation of the great country of China. The Moon Mission 360 will be, and you can visit the different places of China, such as Beijing, Shanghai, and of course my hometown, Hong Kong. Dragons are a powerful symbol of the Emperor's authority. Like the Shirlin Stone Forest, one of nature's unique wonders. Although winter here can last six months, the people celebrate by carving magical sculptures of ice. That makes me want to go to Epcot. Or that, that's, what was, that's what I was just about to say, Tyler. That, that makes me want to go to Epcot. Well, we are at Epcot, yeah. so we're done with that. But it, that movie made me want to go to China. I've always wanted to go to China. Did you have? I always have. But now it's time to, to get some more food. So we're finally making Sarah's dreams come true and trying the cheese fondue from Germany. And of course it's cheese and bread, which isn't the healthiest, but this will be the least healthy thing probably of the evening. Are you excited? Well, that's Sarah's favorite princess right there. Her and little old Snow White. Her and her dad's favorite. So this cheese fondue comes with cheese inside a piece of bread, with more pieces of bread, and then steamed vegetables and potatoes, I think. How's the cheese? It's good. How's the bread? A little hard. Oh, man. Tyler's getting the quick service from Japan because he's never had it. And Sarah and I decided that from the Japan stop, we're gonna get the soup. Because it's like, a lot of the holiday, festival of the holidays is, a lot of desserts and drinks and not as much of like actual entrees but the ones they do have are phenomenal so we're gonna get the uh, soba soup from Japan if it's it looks closed well well Disney you've really confused me so far so I don't know every all the timestamp things say that the festival of the holidays is from park open to park closed I heard from somebody else that the uh, stands for the Holiday Festival, the holidays close a half hour early. It's 8 o'clock. There's still an hour and a half left in the park, and the Japan holiday booth just closed. Like, literally closed like in front of me. So that was disappointing. I was looking forward to that soup. It was like a spicy hot Japanese soup. So, I guess those are the week for another day. Hopefully, we can come back and and see, I think we do have like one or two more days planned to come here before um, we leave for Chicago, which is like, I think in two weeks exactly. So we came to Morocco to get food because all of the, all of the festival of the holidays are closed. And we got the Mediterranean sliders combo with hummus and a pita pocket and healthiness. And we got olives, marinated olives. But look at this cool knife dispenser. It's like for safety. So we're eating outside because it's a practically perfect in every way, right? Okay. It's a Mary Poppins night. It's beautiful out, you guys. Just admit it. Spoonful. These two have been these two have been teaming up on me all night. Spoonful of rice helps the rice go down. <laughs> Here's our pita pocket. We got three different pita pockets: chicken, lamb, and falafel. Mediterranean wraps. We got some beans. We got some chickpeas. We got some salad, and these olives. All this. this Fifteen. That Those were four. With tax. And of course, because we always up. were here in Morocco. Uh, we've been visited by the magical spinning chicken nugget. Oh. Uh, well, for once we did the reverse of what we used to do. And instead of coming to Yacht and Beach Club to relax and then walking over for illuminations, we ran out of Epcot to come to Yacht and Beach Club because this boy started talking to us about the smells of yachtsmen. Mm. And we're like, let's go walk around the lobby, see this Christmas stuff, and. Maybe get an ice cream cone? The biggest pool on property. And it's got real sand underneath. You don't gotta sell us on it. We oh, wanna go into cool. it so bad. A fun place to wait to get into Beaches and Creek. And the arcade is fantastic. It's Lilo and Stitch Team. Look at Lilo. Oh, and look, I think all the horses are named after them from the movies. This is my, one of my favorite characters ever. Right here. Mm. Look at him. 
He's got a little, little tape, little scissors right there. They eat them. All the cast members. Wait, we found, what is this cruise cup lounge? Right next to Yachtsman? We might come here for my birthday instead. <gasps> no, no, no. Prime rib. You can get a prime rib here? This is, that's not bad, look at this lounge. I think we might come here for my birthday instead. 24 hour marinated churrasco steak and truffle fries. Truffle fries, how much? 36. That's not even that bad for what that is. Oh. So you know, this might be my birthday place. Appetizers. We're, we're changing our plans, we're coming to Cruise Cup. Did you see the, did you see the rowboats cut into the wood at the top? Yeah. yeah, that place was fancy, good find. Let's go to, let's go to Boardwalk. So us three right here, we are trouble. <laughs> we are, we are in big trouble because Tyler's just like me, who's just like Sarah, and we all love to talk. Yeah, especially, Disney. especially Disney. We just, Tyler's never seen the, the Shh, illuminations be quiet. The Boardwalk Villas. The Boardwalk Villa open house. And we walk in there and this family of like, what, six? Was it six yeah. or seven? Six. We're in there talking and thinking about the DVC. So we were showing Tyler because he's never seen it. And when I'm walking out, I'm like, the dad of that family was like, hey man, you, you were just selling it to him. You should work for these guys. And so we all started talking. And these two started talking in, uh, to the wife and, we wife and to, the, to the girls. And I was talking to the dad about DVC and the college program. And them, they, they're from Sacramento. So if you watch this video, wonderful meeting you. I hope you uh, bought the DVC if you think it's the best thing to do for your family. They were staying at the Treehouse Village. But that was, um, it was always fun. Like we were just yapping, yapping, yapping. Yep. Disney people just get it. So Tyler's roommate said that he's got to get ice cream while he's here. So wish I was on the snack plan. <laughs> if you were on the. Get a dining plan for local. milk and cookies. That would be insane, and we would be the first ones on the list. <laughs> Look at so we realized. Work directly with your pastry chef team to build your very own gingerbread house. Cost is $120 for up to four. That's not bad for four, I guess. But here is the Boardwalk's gingerbread house because we realized that when we left, when we left Epcot, we wouldn't be able to get back into the gate after illuminations. Oh, look at flying fish and the bench. Look at those benches. I just want to eat one of these benches. Well, we ventured back. We didn't, couldn't take the bus because it was like seven bucks. Don't worry. Sure. Yeah, just make sure you never forget about Kenneth. Yeah, right. Our Uber driver's name was Kenneth, and he used to work for Imagineering, and like recently. Yeah. He gave us good word that we're gonna love Mickey's Runaway Railroad. Is it just Railway? Minnie's Runaway? Mickey and Minnie's. Oh, really? And he was a big fan of uh, great movie rides, so he's like, yeah, it was really hard seeing it go, but like it's gonna be really great. Like he was explaining to us like very immersive in the cartoon world. Yes. So like the a, ride is like a multi-plane camera, yeah? Yeah, like you're, it's the it's ride's really a multi-plane camera and you're the center of it. So like you can see the different planes and everything. I don't know if we're supposed to know that information. I don't know either. I don't think he knew that we were going to put this on YouTubes. I don't care. He doesn't work for, for WDI no, no. anymore anyway. On the YouTubes. But on the YouTubes. Good job, Kenneth. You had a great, great Uber ride. We had, so, yeah. Five out of five. Would ride again. Long story short, we couldn't take the bus because they don't do buses from Boardwalk uh -uh. to Epcot. So we had to take an Uber because the park was closed. Thanks, Tyler. You're welcome. Had to get your ice cream. <laughs> We're at the store late night, but we needed some extra holiday nuts because all I had left were these almond, almonds. And look at this. This has got a good variety. I gotta get a good bag. First of all, we're home. We have some presents over here, but we're gonna show you them tomorrow. They're really awesome. But look at, here's Eve's stocking up with ours. Mm -hmm. And look at this. I didn't realize she did this often, but she just took this piece of rawhide and brought it over to Sarah to hold, like it was nothing. I was like, that was super cute. And Sarah's like, Peter, he does, she does that all the time. Brings over whatever she wants to chew on or hold yeah. and brings it and just puts it on Sarah's lap for her to hold. But tomorrow's Friday and I'm getting off work early. It's been, a, it's been Associate Appreciation Week all week and tomorrow we're doing like a picnic and I feel like it's going to be like the office. And then uh, we're going to- Hopefully gonna, we're gonna, nobody's branch gets- <laughs> Eliminated. Um, and then I get off work early, but we have a fun day tomorrow. We have maybe meeting up with some family that's in town and hopefully going to celebration, but it's supposed to storm tomorrow night. And the first time like in weeks, the weather's been super nice here, but needed rain, but it's supposed to like thunderstorm. Yeah. 
and, so be, we'll and be cold. Maybe, I mean, there's a million things we could do. There's a million and a half things we could do. We haven't really talked about this, what's coming up this weekend, but. We have a lot coming up this we'll weekend and this tomorrow. next week. Yeah, oh my gosh. This, like, just stuff that's already set and late at night, so. Yeah, we'll tell you all about it later. It's good to good be home. Be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>